Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and today is one of the final days of the season, so we're going to be doing some trophy pushing as we always do near the end of season. Currently sitting at 5,163 trophies, my goal by the end of the video is to get inside a Master 2 League and maybe near the end of season get even closer to Master 3. There's only one day and 21 hours left in the season however, so literally it is our last chance at pushing some trophies. Now we are rocking this hog deck over here which I recently did a video on. It is a no legendary hog deck that is a great option for the average free to play player. Now before we begin I do want to just go ahead and upgrade the NATO spell to level 7 as well as the Ice Spirit to level 12. They don't really matter too much, but the extra damage does help just a little bit. So hopefully it does help us on our push. So there we go. Cards upgraded. Let's go ahead here and just jump into our first battle of the evening and see how we can do against this guy up top there from the Swiss All-Stars team. If he's truly an All-Star, then we are in some big trouble here. So, Mr. All-Star, what do you have? Quick question for you guys. What do you think is better in this deck? Knight or Ice Golem? A lot of people tend to use the Knight in place of the Ice Golem. I kind of like the Ice Golem because mine's higher level than my Knight is. And uh, it's a bit faster cycling, but I don't know. The Knight is more popular in this deck. Let's go ahead here. Ice Golem back here. So he's rocking Ice Golem as well. Probably a few Musketeer deck if I had to guess. Uh, maybe not with the guards in there. Truly not sure what he's using right now. It still could be a few Musketeers, but it could be something else altogether. Okay, so that's going to go in there. Graveyard. Graveyard Pump deck? I mean, okay. Guard getting in there. Let's nail that back a bit. Pull the skeletons away from the tower. Ah, that's a decent defense, I would say. Let's do one of these. Hog Ice Golem over here. He's got Bowler in there as well. Guessing Bowler here. Or Tesla. All right. The Musketeer will look onto that tower and get some damage done. How much damage, you ask? Well, let me tell you guys. Let me tell you a story here. Once upon a time, there was a Musketeer. And she got 12 shots on a tower, dealing 2,000 damage. That was nasty, for sure. So you might go ahead and pump here on the left hand side this time. We're going to get a Musketeer going on on this lane. And see if we just can't cycle back to another Ice Golem Hog here. Because his Tesla is... Hopefully he should be out of rotation. He just pumped, so... If we go Ice Golem Hog here, he might be dead. He might not be. What does he got? What does he got? Pekka? I'm guessing Pekka in his deck. If he's got pump in there. We could be wrong. But the Hog will get some work done. Musketeer will die. But the Hog will kill that tower. Now the question is... Do we want to go ahead and fireball that pump right here? I think not. I think just kind of save our elixir for the defense here soon. And see what our friend does. So go ahead and go Musketeer back here. On the left hand side. There there we go. I feel like he's got something, a trick in his sleeve, guys. I feel like he's got something hiding away in there. What is it? What What is it, you might ask? Well, we shall find out shortly. One more Musketeer here to kill this graveyard. Take it down. Nice. Man, that hog already got destroyed by those guards there, dudes. Wow. I mean, he's going to keep going with that. I'm okay with that for sure. For sure. That Musketeer back here is going to natal that. Okay, let's go this. Ice Spirit. Musketeer plus tower should kill it. Let's use Goblins into the log to give him some value because we want to give him some value. Our poor friend is not doing so well. Give him some value town. There we go. Ready for this, boys? I just go distract the guards. There we go. Nice. Man, he's just cycling graveyards like crazy here. Where's your poison, my friend? Guards outside of that. Thank you. And I think our friend is dead, Mr. All-Star there. All right. Uh, he is. Good game. So I think we might be pretty close to 5,200 already, guys. I went on an epic trophy push here a couple days ago when I was trying to fill my gem rush, uh, which was pretty sweet as well. So 29, where are we at? 5,100. And 92 trophies. And also, just a quick heads up here, guys. There is still a little bit of time to enter the $50 giveaway hosted by Misplay. If you're interested in how to enter that giveaway, after you're done watching this video, I will leave a link in the description down below to that video with some more information about the giveaway. But let's go ahead here and jump into our next battle. One win away from 5,200 against another 13 here. We are pretty close to level 13. I think we're a little bit over 5,000 experience away. So probably the next season in January here, I might hit level 13. Um, but I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how things go like that. Um, I was kind of hoping the Ice Bird upgrade to level 12 would allow my tower to one or to two shot the goblins after an Ice Spirit. But it's, or, or one shot is what I meant. So, I don't know. But I guess not. So, what has he got? Goblin Gang Minion Horde. Obviously, an Infernal Tower bait deck. If I had to guess on one deck right now, uh, we're going to go Natalist back. Goblins here. 
Mortar! Oh, baby, Musketeer log on, get some damage done, please. Let's go Ice Spirit here to do some work to that. And we're gonna go Zap here. Musketeer, get some shots off, please. A bit of a risky Zap spell, because he's got Minion Horde here, but we still have the Ice Golem for something, and Fireball too, so. We're sitting pretty good so far, but the deck that he's using is pretty punishing, so one mistake, we could lose the battle. I mean, that's the same thing with basically any deck, but let's see here. Let's go, boom, boom. If he does Minion Horde, we can go Fireball. If he does Bats, we can go nothing. We can go Fireball for this. Look at the Minion Horde in there, and it's gonna go down today, tomorrow, yesterday. One of those days. Eh, I'm not too happy with that play, guys. That push, eh, didn't really have me in. Ooh, nice! Nice log, my friend. We're gonna freeze your Miner, he's looking a bit warm. Uh, so we're gonna freeze him, cool him down a bit, you're welcome. I'll charge $5 for that air conditioning fee. Pedgar, Pedgar, Pedgar. Musketeer get some shots done. Um, I mean, if we keep him using those mortars defensively the entire battle, we're kind of okay with that. But, uh, hmm, we'll see. Mortar defensive. Let's zap these. I want one hog, hog shot on the tower, please. Just one. Uh, that's none. That's none, my friend. <laughs> okay. Pull that over there. Nice, uh, I mean, nice that. Ice Golem will die and do work to that. We're gonna get another Musketeer right here to kill that Miner. Gobby gonna stab on the tower there? What? What is life, dudes? Naked Hog over here. Can we fireball something, maybe? Nah, no fireball. A bit risky if you ask me. Uh, I mean, it's an equal trade versus the Hog, so I'm okay with that. Wait for it, Musketeer over here. Zap this. Got some goblins for his miner here. Does it go miner? Right here. There we go. Oh, baby. Uh, let's nail that to the King Tower here. Activate the King Tower a bit earlier. Nice, nice, nice. I'm gonna go zap a roof for the bath and the minion horde. Hog over here on the right hand side. Get our fireball ready this time, guys. This will be juicy. Fireball in deep. Please use goblin gang into that. Hog one shot, please. Nail this way. Hog one shot. What? Oh, <laughs> so close. 222, can we farble that to death? I think we can, boys. Boys and girls, ladies and gents. And I think he realized that we can farble that tower. Mm. Can we do it? Put your back into it. You can do it, you can do it. Put your back into it. So two of 13s down in a row. Line them up, boys, because they're going down crazy. So there we are, guys. Battle winner. We are now over 5,200 trophies. Are we top 10,000 in the world? Yes, indeed, we are. 7,853 trophies. Are we... There we go. Master 2, thank you. Are we top 200 local? I think we might be. We'll see what it is. Oh, we are. 152 local, guys. We're still a Master 1, guys, according to the leaderboard right there. That's kind of strange how we are one gem in a sea of darkness of hammers. But yeah, let me know what you guys think about this deck. Knight or Ice Golem in there. Knight obviously has more health, is better on defense against certain units. The Ice Golem is faster cycling and also gives you another counter for stuff like Minion Horde because Ice Golem Zap kills Minion Horde, Ice Golem Fireball kills Barbarians, and uh, Ice Golem Ice Spirit does a bit of splash damage as well. But let's go ahead here and jump into another one and see if we can't get a bit closer to 55. Master 3. I don't know, guys, do you think it's possible for me to hit Master 3 by the end of this season? Or do you think that is a bit of a stretch? Because that's still 300 trophies away. And once you get up to, like, Master 2, it, things get, like, tough really quickly. Oh, I kind of want to fireball this Ice Wizzy. Will he walk into there? I want to try it. And he did, son. I mean, uh, it's still not really valid because the Tombstone was almost dead anyways. But he did log there, so we're going to go Goblins here if we can just get the finger down on that. Because we got some fat fingers there. Ooh. Goblin's still tabbing, stabbing the tower. Tabbing the tower. Goblin's still tabbing the tower, guys. <laughs> oh, I'm a nub. Final going down. There does he... He misses the fireball? What? Mr. Jimbo. Oh, Jimbo, 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 buddy. Why are you thanking me? I didn't do that. You did it. Jimbo. Oh, and you missed your tombstone too, Jimbo. Jimbo, go back to Jimbo school, my friend. Oh no, guys. Oh no. The hog did work to that tower there. We're doing okay. We're doing okay here so far. Um, but... 
I don't know what's going on there. He like misplayed like five cards in a row. And he's having a good time though. Um, you're welcome? There's no you're welcome emote, so I don't know what you want me to say. But, I don't know. Please log that. Or one of those. Uh, yeah, that's a possibility. So two fireballs at... Yeah, th yeah, two fireballs. I was doing some math in my head right there, boys. Oh, I just gonna go down and destruct. Destruct that thingy majiggy. Get the our spirit. Does he log us? Hmm. Another tombstone missing. <laughs> Why is he so mad, guys? Oh, no, Jimbo. Jimbo, Jimbo, Jimbo. Let's go, Musketeer back here. What's your win condition, buddy? Graveyard? We're gonna fireball that, Jazz. Kill that. Uh, that's gonna turn around. We're gonna get some goblins down here. Some goblins. And take a bit. Actually, we're gonna zap here as well. I was, I was getting a bit risky there, guys, so I wanted to zap. Uh, things were kind of heating up quickly, so I didn't uh, kind of want to go too crazy there. Let's go, Musketeer, for this lane. Just play defense for the rest of the battle here. Musketeer will kill the knight and also defend the right hand side. She dead? She dead. Right, let's go I'm here. 20 seconds, can we defend for 20? We can, baby. Oh, yes, we can. Log in that. Musketeer here. Stop the build up. Nice. I swim here. There we go. Jimbo, 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 my friend. So, 643, guys. Honestly, <clears throat> we might have been able to play a bit more offense there and go for the 3 crown or the 2 crown, but with 30 seconds left, I felt pretty safe just kind of defending there for a bit. I was playing a bit recklessly because I knew we had such like a lead there, but um, that end defense there wasn't too great. But there we are, guys. 5,253 trophies, top 10,000, 6,000 plays. Are we top 100 local or top like 120? We are 128, pretty close guess right there. We do also have our clan chest to open up right here, so there we go. Make sure recording, scratch the nostril, get some gold, and hopefully get over 200k here. Mm, skeleton barrel, not bad. Bombers? RGs, oh, come on, give me some good stuff here. Give me some good, uh, battle rams, okay. And for the epic, give me um, something good. Something good. Balloons, pekkas, golems, and we get prints. I mean, that's decent. Prefer the P.E.K.K.A. or the Golem or the Balloon, but the Prince is definitely an okay card for sure. Now before we hop into our final battle here, one final question for you guys this video. I know it's been full of questions so far, but I want to know what you think is the number one best deck for pushing trophies on ladder. Because I want to know if I should use the same deck for my final trophy push tomorrow, or if I should try something different. But take a look at my card levels guys. Down here, what do you think I should use for my final push of the season? We got some decent cards, some not so decent cards, but we have a couple of options available to us. So, do you think I should use something else? If you do, let me know what you think I should use down below, or if you think I should stick with the same deck over here, let me know as well. But let's go ahead here and finish off with our final battle of the evening against 187er. Good luck, sir. So, he says good luck as well. That's always nice when they do that, guys. Sometimes they just say thanks, and you're like, hey, Hey, buddy, give me some good luck as well. Ooh, no. Not that tombstone, buddy. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Musketeer will shoot that. Ooh, baby. That's dead. I mean, is dead, please? Oh, the pro plays by Shane. Not so really pro, but there were some plays. He's gonna defend that lane. We're gonna go hog there. Does he NATO us? We can go far up all here. Oh, the far up ball's a bit late. Oh, not really, though. Mm, one more hog hit. So we did a bit of work there, but we kind of spent a lot of Elixir. I wouldn't recommend doing that. We're gonna actually go Goblins here. And he's having a good old jolly time there. Mm-hmm. Interesting. Very, very interesting, my friend. Ooh, not the Golem! Man, if I would've, if I, if I would've known he was gonna go Golem there, I would've went just Ice Golem and Hog on the right, but... Uh, mistakes were made, lessons were learned, and actually lessons weren't learned. Jump, Ice Spirit, jump, jump, jump. Mm. It was an okay push, but not enough damage was done to make it worth it. The Ice Golem back in the back there, guys, was the failure of that push. Can we pull us to our King Tower here? I mean, why not, you know? Whenever you ask yourself why, just say why not. So we're gonna kill that Golem there. Ooh, spicy archers, my friend. Ice Golem here will distract. And... Uh, Ice Gold will die. I'm gonna go Ice Spirit here to freeze that archer. Uh, let's ignore the one archer there. Yeah, uh, that's okay. That's okay by me. So we did a bit of work there. 
I mean, we did something. Whether it was a good something or a bad something, I we don't know yet, but... We'll try this over here. Where's your minion, sir? Mega, there we can fireball that mega. Let's get the- Ooh, the fireball getting the archers as well! Archers? Why did I say archers? Uh, get in there, please. Does he use minions? Let's get here one shot, and two, and three, and tower's dead. Nice, nice, nice. Get this over here. Right there. There's a log in there. Pull this back. Alright, let's go in here. I'm gonna go Goblin, Zapparoo. Nice. Ice Bird here. Ooh, I think we're dead though. Pull it back. Are we dead? Are we dead, guys? I don't know. Uh, Archer's here. Come on. You can do it, baby. Is that them? There we go, there we go. Log going down. I don't think it's enough time. Good game, Mr. Happy Guy. Well played, and good luck in your future endeavors, my friend. I wish you all the best. Man, that was good. That was a decent battle for sure. I wasn't sure if we could defend that final push there, but somehow, some way, we managed to pull it off. So now we're sitting at 5,281. Wow, guys, we're only 200 away from Master 3, and we are 5,000 in the world, and we are locally definitely top 100 now, for sure. Are we? 90th place, 99th. No, we're not top 100, guys. Rest in peace, my dreams. We only moved up a couple of rankings there. Like, our first victory, we moved up a lot. And this one right here, we only moved up like 5 or so. We were 128, maybe? So maybe about 10 trophies or 10 rankings we moved up right there. But honestly, guys, not too bad. Hopefully, by the end of tomorrow's video, we can get closer. Not too sure if I will be able to make Master 3, but uh, that definitely will be my goal by the end of the season. All right, guys, let's go ahead here and just finish off with one final. We're doing pretty well so far. Hopefully, that success can continue here, but good luck to our friend up there. Now, what's funny is, is some days I literally lose, like, every single battle, no matter what I do. And other days, I go on a massive winning streak, so... I don't know how it happens. Let me know if that ever happens to you guys, where days you just win like crazy, other days it doesn't, like, you can't even do anything, you just lose all the time. So I spread it there for that. Um, let's go Musketeer here on the right. We're gonna natal that to our tower. And then drop some goblins in the archer there. Let's go goblins here. And then get a hog on the right here. So we got goblins on the left doing some work. We got a hog on the right, some barbarians going down, and a Tesla. That was a 90 extra defense there, which I'm definitely kind of. Not really okay with. I mean, we did work. We forced out a ton of Elixir on defense. The Barbarians won't get to my tower. We also did a bit of work to his tower on the left-hand side as well. We're actually gonna go... Hmm. I thought we had one more card for the, uh... I thought we had one more for the Hog Rider there, but, uh, we were wrong. I thought we had it, boys, but we didn't. Nope, nope, nope. He's gonna go Hog in the right here this time? Or what? I just call him here. My goal is to outcycle his rotation here with that Tesla Barbarians, because they're expensive. Did he go Tesla here? Iceberg Zap will kill the minions! Iceberg will freeze the tower there! The tower should hopefully take a good amount of damage to the stuff, please? Huh, that's decent. The question is, does he go hog here? And if he do, what's your answer? He do go hog. He do go hog indeed. There we go. Uh... He zapped a bit early, the hog doesn't even get to the tower, and the goblins will force some counter pressure right here. Please use Tesla, uh, Ice Spirit. One goblin getting to the tower, getting and one stab off. There we go. So now we are within two fireball range, which I'm definitely okay with. Guys, we're crushing it right now. No idea why. Literally, last week, this time, I was like losing every battle. And now, something happened. Magicals, miracles are possible. Possible. Oh, yes, they are possible. Oh, the, what? The hog's frozen? Oh, no, my friend. Your hog is feeling a bit chilly. Oh, I wish that could reach. I really wish it could reach. But it can't. No, 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 it can't. Hmm. Let's get here. here. One must get here shot. Oh, what? She got a shot off as she died? That was nasty sauce. Dude. Pull it to the middle. Ice spirit here. Jump Ice Spirit, freeze the minions. There we go. Not bad. We go Ice Golem Hog here. Does he barbs us? He barbs that lane. We can fireball those. Knock him back, knock him back. Musketeer, do work, please. You can do it, baby. She did it. So now we need one more fireball zap to kill that tower on the left hand side there. 
Let's go. Nail to the middle. This here, ice break here. Freeze everything. Hawk should die. It it does die. And Fireball Zap for the win over here. There we go, Fireball and a Zap going down. And good game. Well played to our friend up there, guys. Like I said, we are absolutely crushing it right now. No idea why we're so lucky, but plus 30 trophies, 34 gold, 1 crown, 5,311 trophies, guys, doing A-OK, -okay. top 5,000 now in the world, we have to be top 100 now in the leaderboards over here, in Canada at least, we have to be. Rest in peace, dreams again, 101, oh gosh, oh leg, same trophies, one rank higher, how does that happen? Man, we're one trophy away from being like 99th, guys. Wow. But anyways, guys, that will be the end of the video. Here is the deck one more time. I know I've already done a video on this deck, but at the end of this season, I always do trophy pushing videos, and I always pick the one deck that I feel the most comfortable with, that I'm having the most success with, and also let me know what deck you want to see me use for the final day of trophy pushing this season. But guys, that is the end. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe for some more Clash Royale content. Thank you so much for watching, guys. We will see you in the next one.